The wait is finally over. E Q C. There we go. Finally. The Packers. Finally. Woo! Okay, so I'll try and start Finally. off with why I think EQ St. Brown fell. There are some minor hand concerns. He's average there. He wasn't all that far behind some of the other players there. He's still, he's still very raw. He is very, very raw as a wide receiver prospect. But if you want a height, weight, speed prospect, EQ St. Brown is your guy. He is 6'5", almost 210 pounds, ran a 4.4840 yard dash. The rawness, I think, is why he's fallen. He might need a year to develop, but he's a decent blocker. He really struggled this year production-wise because Brandon Wimbush is a wildly inaccurate passer. Wildly is right. But when he had Deshaun Kaiser, 58 receptions, 961 yards and 9 TDs. He's long, he's lanky as a strider. He is a boomer bust prospect. He's going to be the upside of Braylon Edwards when he was good. But if he busts, he ends up being Lima Swede. Oh, I like EQ St. Brown. His full name, Equinemius. Uh, I'm forgetting the first part there, so I'll get it here in a second. Equinemius St. Brown. I've got his full name, so we'll get to it in a little bit here, including all the middle names as involved as involved in well. But EQ St. Brown, I absolutely love this pick. I think it's a great value pick here for the Packers. It's a steal at this point. Equinemius Tristan Imhotep J. St. Brown go to the Green Bay Packers in round six. One of my favorite picks so far. Say that five times fast. No, I said no, it once and I got it right. It. Equinemius St. Brown, EQ, finally comes off the board to the Green Bay Packers.